Hey y'all. It was Martin Luther King Day yesterday. So I was off. I didn't vlog, but today I'm a vlog. Brush my teeth to wash my face, take my friend home, and then just get my week started. Well, the week already started, but I'm finna get my day started. I need some money, so y'all need a book. Damn, <laughs> I really feel like 2024 is prioritizing yourself. Like, prioritize yourself. Mm -hmm. I'm starting to get back to my old self, like my happy self. And I can just see it in my skin. Malik, say hi to my vlog. Yo, what's good? Right now, we taking my friend home. Then I gotta take my two baby ass brothers to some appointment that they have. I'm just being a chauffeur today. Cooped up like a chicken. <laughs> hey, this is for YouTube. You can't be doing stuff like that. Say hi to my YouTube channel. What about all that? <laughs> Good job. I mean, money, sexy ass, brother. All right, I'm recording, so just. Um, I just came from my brothers. I just finishing their appointments after 50 fucking hours. Now we're about to go inside this one furniture store. She always over exaggerates. Because I just want to see if they have like couches, a little cute couch, and I heard they do financing. So, yeah, you can finance anything. You can finance a dick. Yeah, my shit needs to get financed. <laughs> yeah, so we're at Rana's Furniture. We're about Damn. to see what they have. So if you don't finish the payment, they're going to come take it? No. Oh. Yeah, they will. <laughs> they will. They'll, they, they'll yeah, come, they they'll come to your door. They'll come to your yeah, door, but, you, your shit but you don't got to open it. Okay, we're at Rana's Furniture. We're just coming in to see what they have for me for for my new apartment. I'm good. We're just looking right now. Um, no, I'm just trying to see what I like. I'm furniture shopping. I already got a bed, so I'm not gonna even look at no beds because I already got a bed. Let's see how much this cook. This mattress, this mattress, twelve hundred dollars. Wrong time. No, just the bed itself is. Gotta test it out. Six. Yeah, but the mattress says twelve hundred. That's the plug. The mattress. Damn. He trying to. He trying to. What's this? I don't know. Oh, the base six hundred. All right. So I don't. I already don't like none of their couches in here. Their couches are not tea at all. Oh, this is cute. This is cute though. This one, but it looks basic. That's what you need. Some basic. I ain't going to sleep on my couch. No, -uh, you're not coming over. <laughs> I'm going upstairs. Come upstairs so you can help me pick. Okay. Oh, this this bed. Oh, this couch is cute. Okay, this couch is cute. Hello. This is a cute couch. This is a cute couch. I don't. This should like something in a funeral home. You eat money <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> this is something that you put in a grandpa house. It's like a man cave in the bottom. Yeah, I don't like this. Okay, so we're leaving. This store don't have nothing. She would do shit. <laughs> Good morning. I don't know why every morning when I wake up, I be looking fat, but it's moving day, y'all. It's moving day, and I'm so excited and nervous at the same time. I got an 11 o'clock appointment, so we're on the way to the shop right now. And then I have to pick up a money order, 
so that I can finish paying my moving fee. And then I get my keys today. I'm so nervous. Y'all don't understand. I am so nervous. All right, y'all, so I just finished my client. I'm on my way to Publix to get a all right y'all i'm on my way to public to get this money order so i could go sign my lease and get my keys i'm too excited this morning i was nervous but now i'm excited hold up not checking nigga you you gonna respect the missus you know it's Christmas. I hear the whisper. She fought to take me no wind, this cat nigga can't even see me on your wind, she can't. She fought to fly, nigga, no wind, this cat. She fought to fly, man, no way out of here. She fought to fly, nigga, can't even see me on your way out of here. Alright, y'all. I got the money order. I'm debating if I want to get some food because I don't feel good. So, we just gonna head down towards the apartment and see what they say okay guys we're fucking here i'm about to get my fucking keys oh my god hello do me a favor can you um scan the eyes of moment please thank you Before my camera dies, we just moved in, guys. Apartment tour coming soon. Apartment tour coming soon. Coming soon. Hey y'all, welcome to the first episode of Flash Talk Thursday. Why? Why are you telling me to wait? You should have had all of this together. That's better. Okay, start recording. Go. Start recording. Hey y'all, it's Friday. Happy Friday. I actually just woke up like... 15 minutes ago, my sister woke me up by calling me, but I have a client that booked today, and I didn't know, so I'm so glad that she woke me up. Um, I have two clients today, actually. So, yeah. Today I'm gonna edit my weekly vlog, and I'm gonna drop that. So, yeah. I hope everybody has a great day. And don't forget to pray. So I just want to share this with y'all before I go into the shop. What's wrong with my camera? Why is it so blurry? I just want to share this with y'all that like every day I've been reading my Bible, it's been talking about like deception and you know keeping like keeping God in your life. Basically saying like you know look to God and don't look to others for like the answers that you want to be um, answered in your life like the prayers that you want to be answered look to God and not others and things like not materials or anything look to God because you don't know what these people are doing to get what they've got and in the long run the seed that they sown was out of wickedness and they gonna have to reap the wickedness like that they sow so it was basically all week that I've been reading it was basically saying sow good seeds and make sure that you put God first you know like I've been I've been in my Bible girl era like i always been a Bible girl era but now I really just like I be in it everyday and the Bible be having some tea 
So if you don't read your Bible, just like, you know, when you wake up in the morning, that let that be the first thing that you do. Just read a verse. Like, when I read my verse, I read the full chapter. So I can really understand what it's trying to tell me and break it down and, you know, get an understanding. And then I pray. So... Yeah, I just wanted to tell y'all that. Just keep God first and, you know, deception and sow good seeds. So good seeds. Let me even read y'all what it said today before I go because I got a claim. It said, sow righteousness or yourselves, reap the fruit of unfailing love and break up your unplowed ground for it. It's time to seek the Lord. Okay, like all week it's been saying that to sow good seeds bro because like it's time it's really time to get close to god because you don't know when that day gonna come and you don't want that day to come and you not you know not you don't got that relationship with god because you're gonna regret the fuck out of it and i'm trying to get out to stop the cursing but like it's gonna take me a long time because i like i always say sentences with curse words but yeah that's what i wanted to tell y'all on the AR, how you did that? Check out lift up when you take off, how you did that? You put switches up on your blinkers, how you did that? Your LV bed turned to a legend, how you did that? I seen that back turn to a Louis, how you did that? That look like a brand new booty, how you did that? You got fresh stones and love with watch you, how you did that? You hear some scratches in your closet, why you did that? How you yell and slash that? How I kill a cat? Yeah, hopping around in the two to make back pillows in the back. Yeah, yeah.